if z is equal to 1 minus cos theta plus i sin theta then mod z is equal to modulus of z is equal to modulus of 1 minus cos theta plus i sin theta and since we know that if z is equal to a plus i b mod z is equal to square root of a square plus b square so we can write here 1 minus cos theta whole square plus sin square theta under the root so on simplifying we can write 1 square plus cos square theta minus 2 cos theta plus sin square theta so which is equal to 1 plus cos square plus sin square is again 1 minus 2 cos theta so which is equal to 2 times 1 minus cos theta so render the root so which is equal to square root of 2 into and we know that 1 minus cos theta is equal to 2 sin square theta by 2 so we can add 2 sin square theta by 2 so which is equal to square root of 4 is 2 and root over sin square theta which is equal we can write it as 2 times mod of sin theta by 2 since square root of x square is equal to mod x because it depends upon the quadrant where theta lies sin can be positive or negative sin theta by 2 okay so we can write 2 times mod of sin theta by 2 is the answer so which your option third option is the right answer okay please like share subscribe and support us thank you